should I put sunglasses on? Obviously, I'm driving. Um, I'm super excited because I am on my way to Sephora inside JCPenney for my very own personal free makeover. I don't even remember the last time I've ever had my makeup done. So this is really exciting for me. <laughs> and um, we'll see how it goes. Uh, but I thought I'd bring you guys along and give you like an inside look of how you would get a makeover done in Sephora inside JCPenney. So I'm gonna get my foundation. I haven't had my like foundation truly matched since I worked at Sephora. So it's been a while. But yeah, my face is so bare. I didn't even put any lotion on or anything. So they're gonna hopefully prep prep and prime the skin and I'm going to be playing with a lot of the Sephora collection which I love because it's so inexpensive and like you really can get more for your buck so going to Park Meadows it's one of the biggest malls in Colorado
thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys liked the video. Shout out to Sephora and Sai JC Penny for having me. It was a really fun experience. I've always I love Sephora collection um, because they're very inexpensive, very affordable, and they have great products. My favorite liquid liner, like ever, is this Sephora collection one. I just had it right in front of me. It is the Stylographic Fine Line Micro Thin Felt Liner, and it's waterproof. And I love it because of how micro it is. Super, the head is super small compared to every other liquid liner out on the market. Very black, um, very foolproof because it's so fine and small. I always tell people like that ask me, how do I get my liner perfect or whatever? And I tell them to go in like small strokes, not try and do it in one like go. And I feel like this is the perfect liner for that because it is so small. It like forces you to do it in small strokes. So I love it. It's very inexpensive. Also, these are just stuff I've had, and then I'll show you the stuff that I did get during my visit. Um, this is a Sephora Collection Bow Brow, and it's in this shade Universal Light. I love using blonde on my eyebrows or like a taupe, so this shade's perfect for me. And this is just, I think it's like a wax base. It gives you like a full brow effect, but it's very nice and light. And that's what I use today. Like, you can barely see it on my hand. But it attaches to your hair really nicely. And it just gives you, like, that natural brow, which I love. This is one of the powders that I always carry with me to, for touch-ups. This is the Micro Smooth Faked Face Compact. And this, they have so many different shades in this line. And they're very inexpensive. And it gives you this, like, really nice natural powder look. Then here are some of the products that I fell in love with and I got my mini makeover was the Sephora exfoliating wipes. I got the charcoal ones. The ones I used in store were the tea tree ones. So I wanted to try the charcoal ones, but like I was shook when the, it said exfoliating wipes. Like I didn't know what to expect. I thought it was like maybe a chemical exfoliator that's in it or I had really, I had no idea. But when you pull it out, it actually has these like textured, I don't know, I call them beads, but it's not beads. It's just like this texture on the wipe that really exfoliates your skin. So I bought them for when I travel because I can't take a ton of stuff. And for me, I like to exfoliate like every day because I wear so much makeup. So I really love these. Um, and I picked up some of the Sephora. Uh, eye masks. I've used these in the past before, but um, I don't think I've used the pearl one, so I was excited to try that one. And I also bought the bubble mask. I've never used their bubble sheet mask before, so I'm excited for that. Alright, so these are just some of the few products that I picked up and some that I've had and loved over time. If you want to try out any of these, I would just head into your local Sephora inside JCPenney to get your own custom makeover or mini makeover. The mini makeovers are free. You don't need an appointment to do it. And they can teach you how to put on lashes. They can, you can try on different lip colors. You can um, have someone teach you to do brows. It's more of like an educational thing, which is really cool. Um, they're willing to take the time, sit with you, do your eyes, you know, and kind of walk you through the process. Um, when I went in, I asked for her, I just, I didn't tell her anything because I'm really curious as to how certain people would do my makeup because obviously I do my makeup very, in a very specific way compared to what I got done in the video. So it was really interesting to see like what she came up with. Um, she definitely tried to make my eyes look uh, rounder, which was really cool because I feel like I always do like the classic cat eye shape. So, um, she also used like a flat shader brush instead of a blending brush, which was really interesting to see someone do like a full eye with like a, even though she had blending brushes, like she never used them. And I was like shook <laughs> because I personally feel like I could never do my own eyes without a blending brush. So that was really interesting to see. Um, and it's just a fun way to see, like I asked her, I wanted like an everyday look. That's all I said. 
I didn't tell her like how I wanted my eyeshadow. I didn't tell, I just, we picked out the different colors that I liked. Um, she sh matched me. I really like the Sephora Collection HD foundation. That's really nice. Uh, she also showed me that they have this new Sephora Collection full coverage concealer that's new to me. I don't know how new it is in the store, but it covers. Um, she was showing me on her tattoos how the, the classic concealer uh, compared to like the full fuller color coverage one it's just like completely covered so that was really cool so yeah I suggest you guys all go inside your local Sephora inside JCPenney and try it out and if you do let me know how your experience is and until next time thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you all later bye <laughs>